Hey guys, the shower stopped working. It's crazy because it worked yesterday. Anyway, the water's not coming on when you turn the handle. You see a little bit just keeps dripping out. Let's fix this. First thing we do is turn off the water to the house. And you're going to turn it all the way to the right on this model anyway. And then we can run the water from the hose bib to see if that has really stopped. And it's down to a trickle. We're using a Moen 1222, which seems to be the common mixer for this type of operation. If you have a Moen faucet, this is probably it. We're going to pop the cap off, unscrew the handle, that's going to come right out. I'm going to pull off this little plastic temperature adjustment. And then there's like an outer sleeve. This is the one that keeps the water from going back in. We've got two screws and this will take the cover off. Next we're going to remove this clip and this keeps the cartridge in place. Be really careful not to lose that back behind your uh, shower. Use the vice grips and pull slowly. This can get gunked up and be really tough to pull out. And don't worry, a little water still in the system. Hopefully it doesn't go and uh, go down on the inside. Boom. There it is. Now we can see we're twisting the handle and nothing's happening on the valve here. So we know it's bad. Now there was some water dripping out, so made a little funnel out of this water bottle. This is a lubrication. You're going to lubricate all the seals, get it nice and gooped up, and uh, this is going to make it slide easily for years to come. Make sure you get both sides. And we're going to want to just really make sure it's thoroughly coated. And we're going to do the O-ring as well. All right, now to put it in. Should gently slide in. And we're going to make sure that it's seated all the way. And you can see that it's written HC. You want to make sure that's on the top. Go ahead and put that clip back in. Again, don't drop it. And it'll seat all the way down. Jiggle it until it goes in. Click. I'm going to put that outer sleeve back on and then the outer cover plate and the trick is to get that screw lined into the fixture this is a good time to click like on the video if it's helping you you can order one through one of the affiliate links down below and we'll make sure that you can get the right part. You're going to just keep assembling everything and put it back. And I like to jiggle it and make sure it's properly seated. Tightening evenly is definitely the way to go. Put this temperature adjuster in there. Put the handle back on. I'm just testing to see if it works. Looks like the water poured out of there, so that's a good sign. And we'll finish buttoning it up. Let's put that last bolt back in. And I want to thank you guys for watching. See if this helped you out. Please like, subscribe, and share. I'm going to put that last little button back on. Now we're going to turn the water back on outside of your house. Go all the way to the end and test it out. Look at that. Water's flowing again.
back inside moment of truth and it is a success we are done and can take a new shower today thanks again